Welcome to WebAPA Tutorials. I am Venkat. This is part 18 HTTP put action in WebAPI. In our previous videos, we have seen how to write an action using HTTP POST method and HTTP POST will be used to create the records and coming to the HTTP PUT and HTTP PATCH, these two will be used to update the record. Let's start writing the HTTP PUT is the action and public action result of student DTO update student from body student dto and here if the model is equal to equal to null or model dot id is less than or equal to zero then we are going to return bad request so model should not be null and id should be greater than zero student id should be greater than zero to update the student so once the model is valid then we need to fetch the existing student record from the repository for that where existing student equal to college repository dot students dot where student dot id equal to equal to model dot id dot first or default so this is how we can read the existing record if existing record is equal to null then we will return not found we will return not found response if it is there then we will update the existing student details student name equal to model dot student name then existing student dot email equal to model dot email existing student dot address equal to model dot address we have updated the details then return okay when we actually updated a record there is nothing to be returned we can return the updated record or there is one more status code we can send no content so the record got updated and there is no content to be returned so 204 is the status so here we don't need to put anything so this is how we can write the http put method and let's document the return types the return type we are giving here is 204 no content and bad request is there and internal server error possible and not found is also there 404 not found these are the possible responses and the route here is update so here the route will be like this update so api slash student slash update that's the route and we are done writing the update method let's test it here you can see the http put endpoint to update the student the route is api slash student slash update let's try updating the student details let me fetch the first student details execute these are the first student details copy and paste here and i want to update the name venkat c this time i want to update hyderabad full name that's the data i want to update for this particular record click on execute we got 204 no content so there is no response the status code 204 is nothing but no content so we can see that the record got updated and the address also got updated for more videos like this please like share and subscribe thank you